in Death Valley. That was a butt-kicking of epic proportions. And we knew that Clemson was a better team than Florida State. And the final score would obviously indicate that 45-14. to But this thing was 28-0 at the half, and it could have been worse. And yesterday was a statement of superiority and, I think, anger from Dabo Sweeney and the Clemson Tigers because yesterday they came out swinging immediately. Here is Ryan Radke on Westwood One. Lawrence in the gun, two receivers right, one left. Lawrence claps his hands, gets the snap, back to throw, looking right, fires right on the slant. That's caught by Ross, fighting towards the end zone. In for the Clemson touchdown. Justin Ross with his second touchdown catch of the game. It is all Clemson. Tigers lead 27-0 with 8.58 to go in the first half. It was our best game for sure to this point, and uh, just a huge win. Uh, good to see us look like a, uh, uh, a really confident team today. Uh, it was really good, you know, coming off a game where, you know, we, we a game where we had to kind of find a way to win and didn't play our best game. Uh, so, you know, that's five out of six games I think we've played pretty good. But today was our best day. For two weeks, Clemson, Dabo, Trevor Lawrence, and the rest of this team has heard they're overrated. They're not very good. What's wrong with Clemson? They nearly lost to North Carolina. They nearly got knocked off by the Tar Heels. They had to have that two-point conversion stop. And then they had a buy. And so for two weeks, they had to sit on that and they had to really own it and really grit their teeth through it. And I think yesterday was Dabo saying, we're not nearly as bad as all you guys think and we are going to prove it. They dropped out of the number one slot. Alabama slipped in there. And I'm sitting in the stadium and I'm watching the pomp and circumstance going, okay, yeah, I got it. I I feel it in my bone. This is what Death Valley is all about. And Dabo goes, and we are going to throw the haymaker early. First play from scrimmage, he has Trevor Lawrence throw deep to T. Higgins for 40 yards on the near sideline. I said, oh, they're throwing deep on the first play. Second play, Travis Etienne, their running back, has an option throw to Justin Ross for 23 yards. Think about those first two plays. That is a bomb on the first play, then a running back option throw to their star wide receiver. That was Dabo going, we're getting in the end zone, we're setting the tone, and we are going to run all over this place. And you saw blowout game, missed field goal. He's going crazy on this. Late in the game, they're still running plays up by five touchdowns. Because they were angry, I think, that FSU and Willie Taggart took a timeout when they could have just run out the rest of the clock. That was an angry statement by Clemson to say, we are back. And oh, by the way, for Florida State, shame on you. Because once upon a time, this was a great game. But Willie Taggart, your program stinks. It's an embarrassment. Every part of that thing is an embarrassment. And he says, don't worry, we won't quit. We didn't quit. Oh, come on. Once upon a time, that was the conference title game, and yesterday it was a whitewash.